Gary, it was a, a slow start to the game. You were on your heels. I guess that, that was the, the last thing you wanted at the moment. Well, um, it was a poor first half from us. Um, we actually started the game well, but then obviously that first goal, first two goals, extremely soft. Yes, we can debate the first one's handball. It clearly is, and um, the second one's clearly offside, but it wasn't that for me today. It was, uh, it was just the results haven't been good enough in this period. And, um, um, you know, I feel sorry for the fans um, that... We're not playing the way that I know this club can play and the way those players can play. And um, you work in each week, you feel you're getting somewhere, and then you get a setback, and it's very difficult, very frustrating for myself and for the players. But um, no, disappointed today, especially well, more than disappointed with that first half, especially. And second half, we created more chances, could have scored goals, but ultimately the the performance wasn't the one that we wanted, and, not, and ultimately wasn't the right result, of course. Since coming to the Premier League, Swansea have protected the ball and, and had possession as as good as anyone. It, that just seems to be very uncharacteristic of the team recently. Yeah, and it's um, frustrating because we work daily. I'm someone that's been here for 12 years. I know exactly how that works, and no one knows how better that works than myself. Um, I try and train that every single day since I've stepped up to management. Um, we do, we feel that, and then we're getting somewhere. Last, last week we had an excellent week and, and play, performed you know, exceptionally well against Liverpool up at Anfield, a tough place to go with the principles that, that Swansea have. And, um, and then come to the day and, and it's a drop off you know, from, from where, we, where we should be and you feel you're getting somewhere and then it's a setback. And, um, it's very difficult to, to analyse exactly what, what's, what to put your finger on it, but I'm extremely disappointed. Disappointed for the fans, disappointed for the players, um, and it's not good enough. It's not acceptable. The results aren't acceptable, and um, I'm fully aware of that. You know, and it's for me to try and put it right as much as I can. You mentioned your duration here at the club, and obviously you went straight from being a player to becoming a manager. Does this hurt you as much as anyone? Oh, you know, like I said, I've I know the history of this club. I've been a big part of that history. I've worked very hard at. At what I do, um, player and now as a manager, I work extremely hard and um, extreme frustration. As are the players, you know. It's um, but I have to be very careful now. Um, we're in a, a very difficult situation in the league. We need to get results very, very quickly, and we need to find a way of playing um, that's back to what Swansea expect and, and what I expect and what this club expects. So um, that's, that's the most important part. Do you remain confident, though, that the, the current squad, current setup, is is good enough to achieve that aim? Well, I always have great belief in the players, and like I said before, we've achieved history for this club. You know, I've seen what those players can do, and I've been part of it. Um, we've achieved some fantastic things. We've achieved some fantastic results against um, many good teams, but we're in a period where we can't quite seem to get back to that level. You know, we have periods within this, um, or periods of the games within um, this run that we're on, where we've performed very well. And then we have a dip back, and like last week we performed very well, very unlucky um, not to get anything from the game. But then this week um, we were back to the levels that we we need to avoid. So um, very very frustrating.